welcome to our session today on Study Abroad in the Americas. My name is Lidia Rodriguez. I work with the programs in Argentina, Chile, and Mexico. I am joined by two additional colleagues today, two UCAP colleagues. I will allow them to present themselves. Hello, um, my name is Rachel Ogletree. I am an academic specialist for um, programs in Argentina, Chile, and Mexico. Hi, everyone. I'm Veronica Murho. I'm an academic specialist for programs in Barbados and Canada. Great, thank you. We have a lot of information packed into this presentation, so we'll move quickly. Please feel free to take screenshots of any of the slides. The presentation is being recorded and will be posted to the UCEAP YouTube channel after the fair is over. We will begin with a 30 minute presentation to introduce all our programs in these locations. Then all UCEAP staff will move into separate breakout rooms divided by country to answer questions. Uh, study abroad in Argentina's capital, Buenos Aires. This city brims with fascinating history on every corner from its tango halls and nightlife to its museums, theaters, and cafes. Buenos Aires, often called the Paris of South America, combines European elements such as architecture with a culture and ambiance that is distinctly its own. It is stimulating and bustling during the day, but the capital city really comes alive at night. Restaurants open for dinner after 9 p.m., and weekend evenings don't really get going until 1 a.m. With a million and one things to do in this cultural metropolis, you'll quickly find your niche, niche um, whether it be dancing, music, people watching at cafes, football, the national obsession, to name just a few. In the Immigration and Identity Asia and South America program, you will learn the history and culture of Argentina through immigration. In examining its Asian culture, learn how ethnic ties, economies, and politics have shaped Argentina's sense of identity. Though unique in its focus on Asia, this program also looks at the experiences of Jewish, Middle Eastern, and African peoples in Argentina. Courses are taught by faculty from the School of Social Sciences at the University of Buenos Aires. It's a renowned institution and one of the few in the region specializing in Asian studies. Courses incorporate site visits and field trips to temples, shops, restaurants, and community centers important to Asian communities in order to help you gain a historic and contemporary perspective. This multi-site program, Human Rights and Cultural Memory, splits time in two vibrant capital cities with six weeks each in Buenos Aires, then Santiago. Uh, so learn about the state-led violence that occurred in Argentina and Chile during their respective dictatorships that lasted from the early 1970s through the late 1980s. You'll also chart the differences and similarities of these two countries' transitions to democracy. The topics and experiences of this program could be emotionally heavy, um, but you'll have the guidance of faculty and staff who will help you to understand and contextualize the harsh realities that these countries went through in their recent history. Um, the program does include an intensive Spanish course during the first week and then with once a week lessons for the remainder of your time in Buenos Aires. Our next country is Barbados. With its mix of African and British influences, Barbados is a small Caribbean island with a big personality. Often called the jewel of the Caribbean, Barbados boasts white sand beaches and mild weather. In true tropical island fashion, locals have a laid back approach to life, except when it comes to cheering on their teams in the nation's most popular sport, cricket. Whether swimming with the turtles, exploring waterfalls and underground caves, or experiencing authentic Caribbean culture and cuisine, you're sure to find yourself on an adventure in Barbados. The University of the West Indies, or GUI as the locals call it, is the Caribbean's number one university and offers students the opportunity to study across a variety of departments with unique and plentiful course offerings. Join local students and other Caribbean students from nearby islands such as Jamaica and Trinidad in rigorous academic studies, which is modeled after British universities. As a leading provider of management, business, and finance education in the Eastern Caribbean, UE offers particularly strong coursework in these areas. And if you're interested in marine biology and environmental studies, UE is an ideal location to study at due to its unique opportunities for research. 
UE is located in the nation's capital of Bridgetown, which has that relaxed island feel, including all the allure of beach vibes and swaying palm trees. Given its academic offerings and location, Barbados is a great place to study abroad. Students also have the option to study abroad in South America's largest and most populous country, Brazil. Brazil is known for its effervescent music and dance, rainforests, and delicious food. Most visitors are pleasantly disarmed by the playful and affectionate nature of Brazilians. On either of our two programs in Rio de Janeiro, you'll get to know a city that appeals to cultural seekers and outdoor enthusiasts alike. With breathtaking views all over the city, the largest carnival celebration in the world, and beaches so beautiful they've inspired songs, you'll quickly see why so many of our past students rave about their time here. Studying vibrant Rio de Janeiro for five weeks this summer on the Brazilian Seminars Program. Enjoy the golden beaches, lush mountains, football matches, and the musical rhythms all over town. In this interdisciplinary program, the Pontifical Catholic University, known by locals as PUC Rio, provides an in-depth introduction to many aspects of Brazilian politics, culture, business, and race relations in a compact series of lectures by professors and other specialists. Three days of Portuguese language classes will precede the seminars to help you acclimate to Rio, and an additional week of language instruction will follow. A homestay arranged by PUC Rio also helps you immerse in the local culture in Portuguese language. Study and enjoy seminars related, related excursions around Rio with other UC and international students, as well as other professionals from around the world, seeking immersion into Brazilian society just like you. PUC Rio also offers a sem semester program for those interested in a longer experience in Brazil. The semester program at PUC Rio starts with an intensive Portuguese language program for the month prior to the start of classes. You can continue your Portuguese language studies during the semester at PUC Rio to advance your skills in communicating with locals in your daily activities. Depending on your level, you can take on coursework or even an internship in Portuguese. This program does not have any language prerequisites and although English language offerings are limited, you can take all coursework in English across various disciplines, including business, design, engineering, international relations, sociology, and more. The university offers community service opportunities so you can have momentous interactions with favela community members in a safe way that you would not be able to explore on your own. Friendly, open, and ethnically and racially diverse, Rio will cook quickly have you feeling part of the party as you soak in the lively culture scene. You can arrange to live with Brazilians and share meals of mouth-watering cuisine inspired by European and African influence while gaining insight to the local perspective. Taking the region's natural beauty, setting adjacent to world-class beaches, mountains, and the largest urban forests in the world. Perhaps no other study abroad destination provides more surprises than Canada, an international mel melting pot that attracts students from all over the world. Montreal is a charming urban haven teeming with energy while the locals enjoy world-class dining, endless activities, and beautiful green spaces. Vancouver is surrounded by evergreen forests, snow-capped mountains, and the Pacific Ocean, which offer the perfect balance between bustling city life and the great outdoors. In any city you choose, Canada is a fabulous choice for professional development, hands-on research, and even a bit of French language training. With flights under five hours from California, our neighbor to the north is also a convenient way to find adventure that isn't too far from home. The University of British Columbia is one of the world's top research universities. You can really immerse yourself in the academic culture at UBC as you take courses alongside Canadian and international students who go to UBC to gain access to its outstanding science and research facilities. Some of these include world-leading laboratories for physics, a center for interactive research and sustainability, a center for plant research, as well as the Chan Center for the Performing Arts, one of the world's greatest concert halls. This program is ideal for independent students who are self-motivated and resourceful. From dragon boating to improv comedy to cooking, the student-run clubs offer you a way to get involved on campus, even if you choose to live off campus. 
Vancouver citizens are all about living healthy and enjoying the great outdoors. So get ready to enjoy hiking, mountain biking, rock climbing, sailing, and of course, skiing, all not too far from campus. McGill University is the best ranked university in Canada and is the country's best known institution of higher learning and research. The student body is among the most internationally diverse of any university in Canada, with over 30% of students enrolled full-time at McGill, coming from over 150 different countries. The main campus is situated in downtown Montreal, a charming European-style city bustling with energy. The official language of Montreal is French. Though English is spoken, French is a primary language used on signs and in businesses which makes it easy to forget that you are less than an hour's drive from the U.S.-Canadian border. Although all courses are available in English, you can also enroll in French courses. To help you integrate into the university's community and academic culture, McGill offers many clubs, activities, and events, including an active buddy program, where a local student will provide a helping hand, cultural guidance, linguistic support, and information about student life. This is a limited capacity program, so if you're interested in McGill, please speak with your campus study advi advisor right away. It's hard to sum up the geographical diversity of Chile. This long, thin country is bookended by the Andes to the east and the Pacific Ocean to the west. The Atacama Desert, Patagonia, and Chile's wine country are all fantastic areas to explore. Santiago, the capital, is nestled against the Andes and offers an exciting mix of old and new with colonial architecture next to modern development. Further south, the down-to-earth city of Villarica is located on an idyllic lake in the shadow of an active volcano, making it an adventure wonderland. In either location, you'll get to know Chile's inviting culture and rich history and likely add some distinctly Chilean vocabulary to your Spanish knowledge. So you've already heard about one of our offerings in Chile, the multi-site human rights and cultural memory programs, where you'll study in both Argentina and Chile. Um, but next I'll tell you about our three other programs only in Chile. Uh, applied for the, uh, the opportunity to be accepted to the oldest and most prestigious public university in the country. The University of Chile, or La Chile as it's commonly called, offers an incredibly broad range of disciplines. It is a politically and socially engaged institution known for its particularly great selection of courses in anthropology, history, and sociology. In addition to coursework in Spanish across many majors and disciplines, you could elect to apply for a special program taught in English specifically for economics and business majors. So even if you haven't studied Spanish, you can study here. On-site UCEAP staff can answer your questions about your specific academic areas of interest or connect you with an internship or community service project. Take courses in your major with Chilean students at Pontifical Catholic University. Um, it's regarded as one of the best universities in South America. La Católica, as it is also known, offers courses in most subjects with especially large offerings in biological sciences, engineering, business, economics, and the arts. It's an open-minded institution with an active student body, and while it is a Catholic institution, you do not need to study religion there. Each of its four campuses around Santiago boasts state-of-the-art facilities, and much like a U.S. university, provides great support and guidance, making it easy to get involved in university life. In addition to studying in Spanish, many past students have enjoyed studying local indigenous languages such as Mapuche or Quechua. And as with the University of Chile, many students who study at La Católica participate in internships and community service projects. In the Social Ecological Sustainability in Southern Chile program, Travel to Via Rica, the intersection of society and science, which provides you an opportunity to see the real-time dynamics between both. Over 450 miles south of Santiago, the ecological area around Via Rica is breathtaking. During your studies, you will learn the deep roots of Mapuche's worldview with the natural surroundings and their approach to sustainability. The community relies mostly on tourism, farming, and forestry, and the fixed set of classes all reflect, reflect the importance of conservation and various approaches to sustainability planning. This program is ideal for students studying ecology, sustainability, development, environment, and other related fields. 
and you will also travel for five days to a natural retreat where you further practice field research method. Program field trips are a core of the curriculum and they are physically rigorous, they introduce new environmental settings, and they expand your understanding of the Via Rica community. Enjoy Pura Vida, the simple things in life, with the friendly and welcoming Costa Rican people. Picos, as the locals are called, are passionate about the natural beauty of their country. Costa Rica is one of the most biodiverse places on the planet and is famous for terrestrial biology and conservation, trying to achieve a balance between human needs and nature conservation. Monteverde's world-renowned cloud forest is home to breathtaking views and a vast range of wildlife, which attracts biologists and researchers from around the world. The Tropical Biology and Conservation Program started in 1987 and is a dream for students interested in biology but can also provide a valuable opportunity for any student wanting to do an independent field research project and even documentary filmmaking. On this program, you will get hands-on experience in various ecosystems throughout the country. In fact, when you land in Costa Rica, you will spend your first two weeks on a field trip that includes hiking and camping. After the field trip, you will have the experience of living in a field station Monteverde and in a homestay with locals. You will also spend five nights at a remote field station. You will work with instructors to narrow down the topic of your independent research project, which will be your focus during the second half of the program. To ensure that everyone receives sufficient units, students from semester campuses conduct academic research in the, in the month prior to all students arriving in Costa Rica. The Dominican Republic is one of the largest and most diverse Caribbean countries. It boasts a rich culture and history, friendly locals, and beautiful coastlines. Dominican life is full of music, laughter, dancing, and perpetual sunshine. Personal connections are the social glue of Dominican culture. Chatting with neighbors, greeting locals on the street, and having in-depth conversations with store, clerk, with store clerks is the norm in this friendly Caribbean country. A program arranged homestay will allow you the perfect opportunity to cultivate connections and fully immerse yourself into Dominican culture and improve your Spanish skills. The Community Public Health Program in Santiago offers a great opportunity for students interested in careers in health to increase their Spanish proficiency and expand their knowledge of the social and public health issues in one of the Caribbean's fastest developing countries. UCEAP partners with CIEE to offer you this fast-paced eight-week program focused on public health, mental health, preventative medicine, and healthcare administration. The program is based in Santiago, the second largest city in the Dominican Republic, yet it retains a small town feel where personal connections are the social glue of the culture. Your days will be filled with classroom instruction, field work, and immersive co-curricular activities. After six weeks of courses, you'll gain hands-on experience with local medical staff and community leaders through two clinical field rotations, one in urban Santo Domingo and one in a rural area. Courses are designed and taught in Spanish by the Pontificia Universidad Católica Madre y Maestra, PUCMM, a top-ranked Dominican Republic University and CIE's partner school. Lastly, we can explore the options in Mexico. Mexico has so much to offer as a study abroad destination. With a rich history and culture, the country is crawling with ancient ruins and UNESCO World Heritage Sites, as well as the mouth-watering mouth, mouth -watering food, beautiful landscapes and coastlines and vibrant cities. Most of our programs are based in Mexico City, the second largest city in the Americas. Its museums and cultural sites rival those of Paris, London, and Rome. Here, all the, all the diverse offerings of Mexico's 31 states converge, making the city a treasure trove of experiences. Other program locations include Querétaro, Yucatán, Oaxaca, and Puerto Escondido. Each program site affords its own opportunity for exploration. The Contemporary Mexico program is designed for students who may not have the time or the language skills to spend a full semester or year in Mexico. Spend five weeks examining contemporary Mexico through its history, 
culture, politics, and language. In class activities, field trips and excursions, as well as Spanish language instruction, complement instruction. There's no way to see and experience everything, but you will leave having had an opportunity to question your perspectives against those of fellow students, and perhaps even a small desire to return for a longer period of time. The Field Research in Mexico program allows you an opportunity to devote a semester to a research experience that will distinguish you from most other undergraduate students. You'll explore the real Mexico outside the classroom and conduct your own research project on a topic that interests you. Upon return, you'll have completed your research project, which you can list on your resume, share with your professors at UC, and use as a head start on graduate work. You'll spend the first half of the program in Mexico City, taking classes at the UC Study Center known as La Casa de California. During this time, you will be busy defining your research topic, learning research methods, advancing your Spanish language skills, and taking in several of the historical and cultural experiences the city has to offer. Next, you will go to your research site for nearly three months. Once you arrive at your research site, you enter into the academic culture of professional scholars. A local researcher serves as your mentor and provides you support throughout your program. You will meet with your mentor on a regular basis and they will guide you in preparing for your final research presentation. At the end of the program, you and the other participants will regroup in Mexico City to present your research. UCEAP partners with Child Family Health International, CFHI, to offer the Global Health in Mexico program. CFHI provides on-site support in Puerto Escondido and arranges practicum placements. The practicum will allow you to dig deeper into the healthcare system and Oaxacan culture by learning from local health professionals through rotations in government-run primary care clinics known as Centros de Salud. This opportunity in Oaxaca will help you understand access to care as it relates to socioeconomic status and how it differs between Puerto's low-income and high-income populations. The Leadership and Social Justice and Public Policy Program offers an opportunity to build your leadership skills and explore social justice in the powerhouse political centers of Mexico City and Sacramento. Combining coursework and on the ground experience, learn how the politics and culture of Mexico inform California public policy making. Starting in Mexico City, take university classes as you explore Mexico's political history. During the fall, you study at the prestigious National Autonomous University of Mexico called UNAM and can sign up for an internship with a local NGO or governmental office in Mexico City. In the following term, at the UC Center Sacramento, you'll take a California policy course and an internship with an organization that has ties to or works directly with binational or Latino issues in California. Lastly, the largest university in Latin America, the National Autonomous University of Mexico, also known as UNA, offers more study opportunities than all the UC campuses combined. Its modern attractive campus is a hub of education and cultural activity, as well as Mexico-related research. Popular subjects include anthropology, indigenous culture studies, psychology, economics, and US-Mexico relations. Before the semester starts at UNAM, your schedule is packed with exciting excursions around the city, as well as the intensive language and culture class. Boasting the largest number of museums in the world, as well as plenty of sport and social activities available to students for free or at a discount, you can always find a way to pass the time in Mexico City. And if you want to add an internship to your studies, just check in with the on-site staff at the Casa de California to talk about the available opportunities. We hope this presentation has provided you with a starting point on your study abroad journey and encourage you to explore the UCEAP website for detailed information about program options, finances, health and safety, and more. You should visit your campus study abroad office, their website, or the how to apply section on any program page on the UCEAP website for more information on application steps and deadlines. Contact information for campus offices is also available through the QR code on this slide. 
We also offer office hours where you can schedule an appointment to have a video call with a UCAP advisor to talk about our programs in more detail. You'll find the link to make an office hours appointment through the QR code as well. Once you have determined which program you're going to apply to, you can start an application by selecting the Apply Now button on the UCAP website.